Welcome to John Boy and Billy Playhouse. Today's episode, The Amazing Jumbo. As our story opens, a silver-haired man in a sharp white suit is addressing the crowd at a small traveling carnival in Dothan, Alabama. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I am Colonel Tim Wilson, here to bring you the most amazing animal exhibition ever assembled. Featuring the dancing frog, the singing dog, the bearded clam, and Jumbo, the world's <laughs> smartest elephant. Admission is just 75 cents. Next show starts in 10 minutes. All right, all right, break it up. Hold on there, Colonel. Officer Patty Muldoon, Dorton Police Department. <laughs> this is my deputy, Sam, the world's smallest deputy. Say hello, Sam. <laughs> Go work the crowd. Now, you wouldn't be trying to defraud these fine folks, would you? Some of the acts in this dog and pony show sound a tad dubious to me. Well, officer, I assure you that you're the first Irish police officer I've ever seen in Dothan, Alabama. <laughs> Secondly, I will assure you that all my animals, my frogs, my clams, and my dogs are all vaccinated, fully bonded, and officially licensed by the amusement board of the great state of Alabama. Be that as it be, I'm going to need to see some hard proof that your little menagerie is everything it's cracked up to be. Let's start with this world's smartest elephant. Here. Oh, my proudest acquisition. Captured while I was on a 10-day safari in the darkest Africa. Just had him tested. Jumbo has an IQ of 165. Okay. Well, let me take a look at this paragon. Certainly. Jumbo, come out here. <laughs> Folks, meet the world's smartest elephant, <laughs> the amazing Jumbo. Well, he doesn't don't look no smarter than any other pachyderm to me. You can look at his eyes and see there ain't nobody home. <laughs> ah, but looks can be deceiving, my... My Irish friend, <laughs> excuse me, ma'am, could I ask you to step up on the podium here with me for one second? Yes, ma'am, bring your youngest along with you. What is your name, my dear? A darling butter worm. And who's this young whippersnapper? This here is Hector. Hector, come over here and tell Colonel Tim how old you are. Now, don't say it out loud. Just whisper it in my ear. Now, folks... Jumbo will stamp out the correct answer on the ground with his foot. Jumbo, how old is this little boy? That's right, he's three years old. All right, that's enough. He didn't sing Amazing Grace. <laughs> I'm afraid, Colonel, I'm going to need a little more proof than that. Well, happy to oblige you, sir. Mrs. Butterworth, do you have any other children? Yes, I have a daughter. She's home sick with her daddy. Which is perfect for our demonstration purposes. Please whisper the age of your daughter into my ear. Folks, prepare to be amazed. Jumbo, how old is this woman's other child? Well, he's right. She is four years old. That is amazing. So as you can see, Officer Jumbo is indeed the world's smartest elephant. Time out, Professor. This has got the smell of a cardi trick all over it. Why, for all I know, you and Mrs. Butterworth here are in cahoots. Officer, you have insulted Jumbo's integrity and besmirched my good name. <laughs> see, your hurtful allegation has caused him to turn his back on you. I see that. The trunk is the larger one. <laughs> his backside ain't his best side either. Okay, Colonel. If Jumbo's mental powers are so keen, get him to tell me how old I am. It would delight me to honor your request, sir. Jumbo, how old is Officer Irish... In Dothan Muldoon. Is that some code? <laughs> Here now! Why is he sticking his tail up in the air like that? <laughs> I could 
be jabbers. He's right. I'm farty too. <laughs> We hope you've enjoyed John Boy and Billy's Playhouse. I'm glad I'm not turkey tree in a turd! <laughs> Tune in again next time when we'll hear the crusty old dancer at the Hoochie Coochie Show say, Hey, big man, let me hold the dollar.